Hello all you happy people. Welcome back to more Shining Force. This is it. We're finally gonna fight Kane. We can finally beat the hell out of him for all the... For mur we can get re finally get revenge for him killing Varios at the beginning of the game and turning Runefrost into uh, fucking enemy... Jeez, I can't even find my damn words here. For basically being a dick. And all the other shit he's pulled. However, this could be a pretty... This should be a pretty tough map, as... I'm showing off here. We got a line of golems here. That's gonna be one thing we gotta get through first. We're gonna, we're gonna use the spellcasters on them. And then we got these douchebags. We got mages that can do freeze. We got this guy who's gonna heal everything. The problem is, we're gonna try and... As we're wailing on these fucks... He's gonna try and start healing them, so it's gonna be a like battle trying to get rid of these dudes before he keeps them alive. And then of course once we get over this way, we got two Dullahan, Dur or Durahans as they're called, which I believe I showed off last time before my end of the video. And of course they were the map one of those was the boss of the last damn map. Uh, they're the Master Mage, another healer, and Kane himself who is pretty ridiculous. That sort of darkness he's using, by the way, he, if he actually uses it in, as an item, can instant kill a character regardless of what his HP was. So yeah, fun stuff. But yeah. We're gonna do this, so... Oops, wrong button. Domingo, get your... Get your ass over here. You're gonna, oh, that's right. They move. I forgot about that. So now it gets even more interesting. Xylo, you get over here too. Henri, you stay back here but within range so you can- Oh shit, I forgot about those guys. Okay, we gotta get rid of them first. Uh, but Gort, you go there. Okay, I, the good thing is I don't think they're gonna come past the damn bulbs. At least I really hope they are. We gotta go up here and take care of these fucking gargoyles. Get him, Luke. I said get him, not miss! Jackass. Alright, well let Kukichi take a swing. Now, uh... Oh, nice shot. 5 EXP. I do believe... You can't reach him, man. You can't fly through that, which I guess makes sense. Once, uh... At level 20, once they hit 21, the units should auto-promote. If they don't, then I'll just promote them manually, of course. See, I'm not sure... I have to read... Probably should have read this beforehand. If... Uh, they can get stat increases one on the level from 20 to 21, which should promote them, because if there's no stat increase, then there's no point in doing an actual level up, and, uh, wasting time, so it'd be more, you should just, uh, as I'm rambling and stumbling all over the place, you should just go and manually promote them. Also, this is the first map where we're using blue. I brought him in as, at the end of the last video, which then, then it actually makes sense, it's a good thing that Kokichi didn't kill that damn dragon. Uh, here. Freeze 3. Or Gargoyle, rather, not Dragon. Bam! Good, we'll let Blue get that kill, too. Maybe. Because Blue's gonna need the... experience. Alright, Silo. You're gonna stay there. Gort, you guys, since Blue's gonna be killing these things, I'm just gonna sorta... Wait, there's Kukichi. Alright, well let him go up here and weaken this thing. Nice. Okay. Henri? Oh, no way. Alright. Stay there. forward. Gong, you're gonna go forward. This is gonna be a 
really fun fight. Chris, I'll have you stay right here just in case. I should have had you use quick on blue, damn it. That's what I should have had you do. Balmeroy. Everyone's getting ready to fight these golems. Luke. As soon as blue gets a damn turn here. Oh, you guys can just stay like that. That would be amazing. Here we go. Alright, Blue. Hit him. I don't know if you have range or not, but yeah, Blue's a dragon. He's awesome. Five damage. There's 48. He starts out at level 9 and can be a little slow to get going, but he's well worth the investment. Which is why I'm training him. So now... Waiting for one of my mages. Alright. Gort, come down here and wail on this fucker. See how much you can hit him for. Yeah, that's what I thought. 80 XP. Xylo, you hit him too. Now, the, of course, the shitty part. Unless Xylo can crit this thing. Oh, so damn close! is that mage is going to heal him. However, this is where it gets pretty fun. Freeze three on four of these bastards. One down. And I got the priest. Awesome. And two of them are within death. Unfortunately, she can only get a max of 48 experience, but hey. Now that I'm gonna remember... Oh, that's right, you've got Aura. Quick Blue. You know, I probably... Maybe I should have boosted him, too. Balbaroy! Get up here and take out one of these dudes. Just so they don't get healed. I said, God, Balroy! Oh no, don't shoot Kokichi. Wait, you got range? Oh, you're casting muddle. Screw you. Um. Alright, Gong, you hit one. Thank you. Seven damage. God, I love Gong. Level 20! Attack by 4? Holy shit! Defense by 1, speed by 2, maximum HP by 1. If that's any other, like you needed, like, oh my god, like we needed any other indication that Gong is a freaking powerhouse. Oh, are you actually swinging now? 4 damage. That was a boot to the head. Tell me quick, ain't that a kick to the head? Hit the mage. Nice, Luke. 16 damage. Kichi. You over here. Um. I'm more worried about the damn mage than I am. Nice. 17. The mages will just cast Freeze and try and wreck us. Then the golems will hit pretty hard too, but the golems are on death's end. Don't are knocking on death's door. See, just hit me for seven. That kind of smarted. And now he's gonna heal him. Why would you cast level four when he's right in front of you? Whatever, waste your MP, you dumb fuck. Alright, guns, get over here. Take that thing out. Damn right! 20 damage from gun- Oh my god, guns, you're awesome. Oh god, here come the Durahans. Blue! Take him down, Blue. And he missed. Oh, double attack! Sweet! 
was really worried there. One more and Blue gets a level. Domingo! Okay, I want the majors. Gotta hit both majors with this. Boom! 15 damage. Priest is gone. Mage is gone. Good. Now we don't have to worry about magic. Domingo gets 34. 21! Speed by one. Now, is he gonna promote? I guess we'll find out in a minute. Here, do this. Um. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. I thought he was going to. I probably should have had Zylo hit the other one. Just because he's strong enough to actually do good damage to it. Speaking of damage... Oh, that's right, it was weakened from the damn spell. Okay, golems are dead. We just have those idiots. Fucking master gong here. He's turning into a monster. Oh, good. Alright, Blue. One more to go. Bam! Another, another one bites the dust. Alright, let's see what his level is. Level 10. Attack by 3, speed by 2, maximum HP by 3. Awesomeness. Just complete awesome. Now we can march forward. Uh... careful here. Uh, see if I can start wailing on him with Domingo from afar. Until I can get everyone else in range. Here we go. We'll focus it on Kane and hit the other two fucks as well. It's 15. Ten the cane from a freeze three, Jesus. You only got thirteen experience for that. And now Gord's gonna start on this dull hand. Jesus, these things are beastly. Silo there, so just in case. Oh, good. Kane didn't move. And the mage decided to swing his... What? Shit, he froze Domingo. Can you hit anybody from here? You can. Well, by all means. Bye, mage. 
And that dull hand's gone. Good. Damn, that's a lot of gold. Alright, now you can move forward too. Alberoy, get up here. Guns. Maybe he'll wait to make you up. One damage! Gun! He was already asleep. But as I was saying, jeez, I love Domingo. And now he's gonna heal. He healed himself? Okay. Sure, why not? Whatever, I don't care. Uh... I want to get rid of everything else, really, before I start wailing on Kane. Yay, Domingo's up. Alright, we gotta get rid of this guy. I don't know if Xylo can one-shot him, but we're gonna find out. He can't do that when he misses. This would have killed him. Still damn near killed him. Gort hits 20. Attack by 1. Defense by 1. We'll take it. Uh... Kong, just sit where you are. Blue. You in. Balboroy. I'm not ready to start attacking Kane yet. Henri! We're gonna do this. And that'll get rid of the mage, and it should get rid of the Dullahand, and it'll hurt Kane too. Good. He's gone. Ooh, 18 damage. Nice. Nice. Alright. Let's get going here. Spear his ass. Nice. Oh, Jesus. Four damage, that's it? I need to get you up there. Luke's gonna go on this side. Oh shit, deadly attack! Nice shot, Luke. Domingo. You're gonna stay where you are. Yeah, stay where you are. D Soul ain't gonna do shit to him. Let's do this. I want. Come on. There. I want. Max. Slash Adam here to get the last kill on him, so I'll have Domingo boost him. Plus, Domingo's got enough experience. He's moving! ARE YOU FUCKING KIDDING ME?! HOLY SHIT! Okay, he just completely wrecked my face. You guys will join me when I get back to beating his ass again. I'm actually gonna leave this one in because someone, uh, I know someone's gonna enjoy it. He, anyway, see you in a bit. Okay, coming back real quick because Luke just hit 20, and he too got an attack increase by 4. That's ridiculous. So I had to show that off at least because he actually went and uh, critted a damn gargoyle in the face, hitting it for 36 damage and just destroying it. So yeah, I just wanted to show that real quick. And yeah, I'm taking out gargoyles and then more fun jumps. So yeah, see you in a few. Alrighty, we're back. Time to kill Kane. Got him by himself, took out the Durahans and stuff, so Kane took a little bit of damage from the area of effect spells that Domingo and Henri were casting, so he took a little, he's, I weakened him a little bit, but that's about what he was at when I got destroyed by him last time. 
Also, funnily enough, he decided to start attacking Domingo. And Domingo has been tanking like a champ, which is amusing as hell because he's a mage. Just shows you how much frickin' defense he gets. And even though he walked up and wailed on my main hero for 43 damage and one-shot him, Domingo only takes 14 damage from him. Which is just... I find that hilarious. But again, it goes and shows you just how frickin' powerful Domingo is. Even though he doesn't get his most powerful spell, Freeze 4, until level 26. I did some research on that. I was worried that somehow it glitched and I didn't get it or whatever, but no, it's fine. Gong, you stay put. Kokichi, you walk up and shove a spear up his ass. And miss, I mean, that's fine too. Henri, you are gonna stay back here and freeze his ass. So we're just gonna have to slowly whittle him down. Nice, 12 damage. I'm also gonna start promoting... It might be at the end of this video, or it might, I might just wait until the next video. Luke, you get in here too. Balbaroid, just stay over there because you'll die instantly. And now Guns is gonna swing. And punch him in the face for 9. Beautiful. Blue, you can stay over there too. Domingo, you're going to take a step back and freeze. And this should set him up for Adam to walk in and take the kill. Providing... Please don't kill Silo. Shit! 39 damage! Whatever, I'll get Silo back. Gord? No. Gukichi? No. Henri? No. Here we go! Hit him, damn you! Got him! Five damage, just enough! And he hit level 20, nice. Speed by three, maximum at- Why the hell would he need- Never mind. He anyway, Kane's dead and his- Mask is breaking. Ugh, my mask is breaking. What the hell? Where am I? I remember now. Dark Soul masks my face to control me. What have I done? He even made me fight you. Forgive me, Adam. So wait, Kane is a good guy? It seems that Dark Soul is behind all the evil afoot. Stop him at all ends, and stop him, and it all ends. In any case, let's take another look at this village. Check the shrine again. That's the idea. So now we're gonna go check the shrine. Yeah, see, I thought so. It showed the chest is closed, but we already got him. Now, check the, it said check the shrine, but can I go back in here? Yeah, see, there's, and that's the weapon shop. Just in case there's another fight, I want to go promote real quick. Never mind, we can't. Wait, yes we can. Where the hell? Where is this damn church? See, that's the shrine. That did stay in put for a moment. Hey, it's spoken again. Oh wait, I found him again. That's right, we found him the first time. No. Hell with it, let's do it! Okay, so now we have to come in here. Dragon Shrine, the door for the door opens for two heroes who come forward and show the way. This door will only open for two heroes. me to the door. We must stop Dark Soul at any cost. I want revenge for what he has done to me. We must keep that manual from him. So Kane's gonna help me open the door. Okay. Two heroes. I have waited long for such as you. Who the hell is talking? Okay. 
so we go down here. Oh, that's not good. Okay, feeling more like yourself now, are you? This is the end, Dark Soul. Adam, get out now. You'll only be destroyed if you stay. I can't let Adam go. Now that I have what I wanted, I have no further you need of him. For you see, dear friends, I have both the key and the manual. Oh, fuck. Well, that's wonderful. Dark Dragon will soon be free again! Go, Adam. Run! I'll deal with Dark Soul. And he shoves his... Um... Okay, that worked well. Now what? I guess we're just supposed to leave? This was... Was there anything down here? Just that, that's right, okay. It's funny, I just did this. Anyway. Wrong way. We're going this way. Okay, I guess there is no damn thing. So Kane, so Dark Souls got the damn shit already. Wonderful. Ain't that just great? Well, we're gonna go. Through the damn mountains. Get lost, uh, that's wonderful. Oh, that's right, we need to go back that way. So we're back here, because I'm pretty sure we gotta talk to Karen. <laughs> Thank you. I just did this. Ah. All right. Well, we'll do this here. I'm gonna save. And we'll actually stop it here, because we've been doing this for a while. Um, and when we... When I cut... Uh, stay tuned next video for... The continuation, obviously. And, uh... Well, it's... Like... <laughs> as I'm coming up... As uh, my words are escaping me. But seriously... We took... Kane is seemingly dead. He attacked Dark Soul, who killed him, and or something. I mean, there was a big explosion. Kane is nowhere to be found, so it's, he's presumed dead. Dark Soul's got the manual and the seal, so now he can revive the damn dragon. I mean, this is just going freaking great. So we have to stop him somehow, and we'll figure that out next time. So until then, everyone. <laughs>